we remember before you this day our brother Matthew and all who have lost their lives to violent acts of hate. We pray that the gifts of all your lesbian, gay, bisexual, transgender, and queer children may be recognized, welcomed, and celebrated in the world and in your church. In your holy name we pray. Amen. The hate crimes bill, the federal hate crimes bill was passed and it bore not only Matthew's name, but that of James Byrd, the African American in Texas who was chained and dragged behind a pickup truck until one arm and his head were severed from his body. And the reason we need to remember that is that the bigger picture here is what we human beings tend to do, which is to label someone different from ourselves as other, which is code for not really human, and then you can do anything to them that you like. Violence takes lots of forms. And right now, the transgender community is the target. There are forces about who would erase them from America, deny them the right they have to define themselves. And they need us to stand with them. This will be the part where I cry. So I have three things I want to say to Matt. Gently rest in this place. You are safe now. Oh yeah, and Matt, Welcome home. Amen.